Jeremy, obviously you would have liked a different result tonight, but tell me a little bit about what it's like playing in this building. Yeah, obviously it's you know it's pretty cool. Uh, you know, obviously you see uh, the fan base come out uh, for a game like this for us, and uh, you know it's pretty special considering you know there's a big game tonight. Obviously for the big club playing, you know for positioning in the playoffs, and uh, you know obviously Tampa's a great team to come watch as well. So uh, you know that'll be a fun game, but for uh, for people to come out and support us, it's awesome. And you got on the board early on in this one. So was that third period just a case of you guys getting tired legs, or? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what it is. Obviously, uh, you know, we'll break it down. But um, you know, we gotta. You know, we have a big kill there, and obviously, uh, you know, you want to bring that momentum into uh, you know into the rest of the period. And you know, obviously, their big line found a couple. So uh, you know, it's obviously something we gotta clean up coming in playoff time. Big lesson for you guys against a team like that, uh, nailing it down on the third. Yeah, I think you know, anytime you blow a lead like that, I don't, I don't think anyone's happy. And I think it's a lesson for uh, for the whole group, and obviously a little bit of a wake up call. And you know, it's hard for Kazzy to come in like that, but uh, you know, he gave us, you know, he did great and he gave us his best. And uh, you know, we got to play better in front of him. Hunter Beal saying you're one of the best playmakers in the league. Uh, what stands out to you about him? Uh, he might be better than me after that first pass. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, no, Timmy's, you know, he's a great kid. He's, uh, you know, he's nice. He's a really nice kid. Uh, you know, those young, those, those young Swedish team men are, you know, they're a treat to play with. Um, you know, obviously Timmy's a great skater and he's, uh, you know, a great playmaker and, you know, very smart. So, uh, you know, he has a bright future for sure. Anything stand out in particular about Raskin? Um, I just, you know, he does everything. Obviously, for being a smaller guy, you know, he puts he puts his hands through another, he puts his ass through another guy's hands, and you know, obviously, he's a he's a great player, and uh, you know, he separates guys from the puck, he makes plays, he, he does it all. So, uh, you know, I think that's a bit of a steal in the draft for them for sure. Bit of an, Go ahead. Bit of an excited reaction we saw from you on uh, Liberty's goal. What was it about that got you so excited? Uh, Vinny doesn't have too many, so. Um, <laughs> You know, obviously, Vinny's been a you know an older guy from day one for us, and uh, you know he's been uh, he's been great to myself and uh, you know all the young guys. So uh, anytime Vinny gets on the board, it's pretty exciting. You've had a great season offensively. What other things do you want to work on this season? Well, I think uh, you know you just got to continue to evolve. Obviously, everyone's goal is you know to play in the NHL, and uh, you know that's obviously a goal of mine that you know that I have, and uh, you know whatever it takes to get there. So uh, you know you just got to keep uh, building every day, and uh, you know it's a process, and uh, you know in the end it'll work out. And the defensive game too, I guess. Yeah, I think, uh, yeah, I think, um, you know, if anybody will, will talk to you, I think defense is, uh, you know, obviously one of my weaker uh, attributes for sure. But, um, you know, try to get better as the year goes on and, you know, just try to uh, just do your best out there.